This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. All right, so we got uh, Brick Baby, um, you know, going at it with Cowboy on Clubhouse. Okay, now, um, Brick Baby, I know a lot of you guys in, in here might be like, oh, I'm familiar with Brick Baby. I'll see him do this interview and that interview. He's not, like, known for that much. Cowboy, you only know because he was, like, around Nipsey sometimes. He was like one, you know, someone that was around, okay? Like he was around the neighborhood and knew Nipsey his whole life, okay? But, you know, you didn't see him a lot, you know? Cowboy was around, but, uh, you know, he's more behind the scenes. Brick Baby. He's just an L.A. guy, you know, like anybody else, but he's not really, like, the fact that people were doing a ton of interviews with everything is a little... It's like whatever, but you know, you can think what you want of it. But I think the cowboy taking the stand, you could believe what you want on that. But on this situation, you know, Eric Holder took out Nip in cold blood, bro. It's like th th there's nothing justifying that or anything. It's not even hood business. It's just like crazy, you know? So, you know, we know Eric Holder's doing pretty much the rest of his life in jail. Um, they, they say he could get out in 20 on good behavior that some people say that, but, you know, hopefully he just stays in there for the rest of his life. Um, but of course, you know, cowboy hits back cause he's like, yo, who it, like brick baby's not really a factor, you know, <laughs> and he's not, but, uh, let's listen to this. It don't have to be addressed anymore and everything like that you know but you know anytime i hear something you already know me cowboy i'm gonna bring it to the table because i'm like i you know i i think the the big homie got a got a right to you know hear what's going on and, and say what he got to say about the situation as well you know what but with that being said you know one of the most recent responses you know i heard was something uh very specific that was said by um you know brick baby about taking the stand he said that uh Nipsey wouldn't have wanted you to take the stand either. It's not just, you know, him and others. You know, Nipsey wouldn't have want you to take the stand. You know, um, what do you got to say against against that? You know, him basically putting that out there, you know, and standing on. Uh, you know, what have you done? You know what I mean? You're not a public figure. You're not a leader. You know, so what, 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 what should I, anything you say, what, what, what weight does it carry? It don't carry no weight. You ain't been nowhere. You ain't done nothing. All your stories is about drugs, getting high. You feel me? You're just a little drug baby. You know, you ain't never really done nothing. They never been nowhere. Ain't never, well, you know, what, 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 you know, who are you? You know, who are you? What have you done other than just talk about other people that's more popular than you? You know, I feel speaking on this nigga downgrade me. Number one, you ain't hood. You feel me? Now you retracking shit. Oh, cowboy, that's my big homie and all this. Oh, shit. Nah, I ain't, you ain't my little homie. Cause you straggling the fence. Nip was your homeboy. And then he talking about you took a fade with Nip. Put line. You ain't never took no fade with Nip. Knock it off. I remember when his big homie jumped out and they acted like they wanted to do some fading. Feel me? And the other shit he could have jumped out. So quit acting like you jumped out and you did some, took a fade with Nip, bro. Knock it off. Cause when your other homie jumped out, with the first the first arms around your big homie neck was mine. And I'm like, who was this nigga? The fuck, they got going on. So by you saying this, so what? It, what was? Is this some underlying shit going on? You must have. But you been had animosity with them. But you feel me? Don't be acting like you took no fade. You ain't never took no fade, bro. You feel me? Why wouldn't? Why you ain't took a fade with me? Then? Well, he did. He did actually also say he said he called you out for. A, for I mean, I, I ain't heard it, but I'm just saying he said he called well, you out like for a fade. It was nobody, waiting. Ain't nobody called me out and all fade. that. And ain't nobody waiting nowhere. I ain't. Yeah. I ain't. I ain't never seen cuz at a funeral. We just had a big funeral. Huh. Everybody flew in. Good nigga. I mean, you know, people are gonna keep punishing cowboy for digging this day. I mean, you know, this is like. This whole thing just keeps dragging on and on and on. Um, <clears throat> it is what it is. But uh, I'll get back to you guys in a little bit with some new news. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Peace.